Yeah, what are you gonna do if there's a picture where you have to not smile? I can't! I just can't! Everybody, please rise. Good evening, good evening, yet again. Friends, family, some co-workers, and the rest of y'all that I don't know. <laughs> we are gathered here today in the sight of God and the joint lovely marriage hood between Brandon and Jessica. The Webster Dictionary defines love as a quote, quality, or feeling of strong attraction or constant affection, feelings, and dedication to one another. In simpler terms, a sexual desire as well. <laughs> Don't quote me on that. <laughs> However, the strong affection and tenderness by others and loved ones. In the beginning, God said, let us make man after our image and our likeness. He, as in God, but be ye fruitful is what he said, and replenish the earth and multiply, which means, in layman's terms, when we get finished with this right here, 
Y'all can do what y'all got to do with them sexual desires. <laughs> yeah, you understand? His words. Mine, okay. It's in the Bible. Okay. <clears throat> now, the Lord also said it is not good for man, Brandon, to be alone. Can I get amen? Amen. amen. All right. Now, so see, he shouldn't be alone. I will make him a help meet, which is the woman, Jessica. Okay. Mm -mm. For this is now bone of my bone and flesh of my flesh. We all can agree? Yes. Yeah. Amen. Therefore shall a man, Brandon, leave his mother and father and cleave to his wife. Jessica. <laughs> Therefore, also a woman, Jessica, shall leave her mother and father and cleave to her husband, Brandon. Can we agree? Amen. Amen. Okay. And they shall become one flesh. I need everyone to say that with me. One flesh. Great. Y'all doing good. <laughs> Stay with me now. Stay with me. Okay. Marriage is also honorable. In all and all things, which means nothing can come between that. The marriage bed is sacred, which means ain't none of y'all breaking that up. Is that understandable to everyone here? <laughs> no? I help you, okay? When they say the I do's, that means you can say thank you. No. Now, I'll talk to you later, my friend. No worries. <laughs> The bed is undefiled, but whoremongers and adulterers shall be judged. That's what I told you I was going to teach you. Which means you could get in trouble, but I got your back. I love you too. Okay. Love suffers long and is kind. Love envies not. Love is also not vain. Love is not puffed up which means fate in layman's terms for those that do not understand fully. It's not fate. It's 100%. <laughs> love beareth all things, and love also never fails. Can we agree? No. Amen. Amen. But when that which is perfect will come, then that which is does not measure up shall not be done away. Can we agree? Amen. Thank you. Now, when I was a child, in this situation, it's you, Brandon. I spoke as a child, correct? Correct. I understood as a child, correct? Correct. Okay. I thought as a child, correct? Correct. But when you became a man, or a woman, Jessica, in your case as well, you put away the childish things. And now pride and faith and hope Strong three-word bond. However, love out of these three words is the strongest of all. Can we agree? Amen. Amen. Now, may I have the rings? Oh, oh I'm well, sorry. I didn't see. <laughs> I apologize. Forgive me. I was expecting a little one to come through. <laughs> Forgive me. That was not part of the plan. Hold on one second. I was waiting for the little boy. I'm so sorry, teammate. Okay. Brandon, which one is yours? Black one. Perfect. Thank you. Wasn't ready for that part. Brandon, Brandon, Brandon. I apologize. Do you, Brandon, take Jessica to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. You sure? I do. Because I, I, I hold the rings, so I just wanted to make sure yeah, that you I do. do. I do. Because this is it. I do, I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. Okay. <laughs> Now, with this ring, I will allow you to put it on her finger. Make sure you are ready, are you my sure? friend. I am ready. <laughs> am, I, am I ready? Push. 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 I don't know how you get it off there. <laughs> Push. There you go. There you go. I don't want to hurt you. This is love. It's okay. It's love. <laughs> Offer it. 
Now, Jessica. I'm sorry. Not yet, my friend. Almost. Getting there. Do you, Jessica, take Brandon to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. Are you sure? I'm sure. Perfect. I'm nine years sure. Nine years sure. That's nine beautiful. Sure. It's funny. <laughs> now, with this ring that I hand to you, you are 100% sure. 100%. No turning back. No turning you back. No turning back. Bond is sealed. <laughs> there is no coming back from this. This, again, is love. Now, I wanted to say a quick prayer over the rings and the marriage. So if we can all bow our heads, please. And if you two could hold hands really quick for me. Lord, we are here today to honor that that is honorable amongst all things. Love is going to keep these two together through sickness, health, wealth, brokenness, and everything in between. Let this marriage be strong and as a symbolism of love towards you, Lord, and allow it to shine bright to everyone that is, that is watching this and understand that this is more than just saying I do. This I do is forever. This is a bond between two people that have loved each other for going on 10 years, Lord. Make it last another 80. Can we get an amen? Amen. amen. Okay. Now. Brandon and Jessica, I did want to tell you, with the power that is invested in me by Universal, hold on one second, y'all, <laughs> Life Church, and by the state of Nebraska, almost forgot where we Woo! was, dadgummit, I now pronounce you both man and wife. Woo! <laughs> Y'all didn't wait. Y'all didn't, didn't wait. Y'all didn't wait. Y'all messed up. Y'all supposed, supposed to wait till I said you may kiss the bride. So we're going to try again. <laughs> you may kiss the bride. All right. uh, that was supposed to be one kiss. One kiss. We're going to save right. the rest for the reception. All right. Now, it's all right. Now, I want to let everyone know as well. I love you all, okay? And this is not no joke. This is very serious. This is a bond between two people yet again that love each other, and we are all here to support both of them. Everyone here is symbolizing a form of love. The sun is in my eye. I am so sorry. <laughs> everyone is here showing a support of love to the bride, to the groom, and to everyone that is here. Everyone has a history with everyone standing up here today, and we are all here as a family and as one joining together. Can we agree with an amen? Yeah. All right. And then you two may go ahead and kiss one more time and leave.
said, my name's Creighton Grady. This is my youngest daughter. I would, only like, I would only like to say this. As my kids were growing up, I always thought the daughter that would end up on the back of a motorcycle was this one. Turns out it was my oldest daughter. But I gotta say, I, I am very happy. You, you guys have been through a lot together. And I can say that I feel very comfortable in the fact that you're in really good hands. And that means a lot to me. And you have a lot to do. <laughs> so to everybody, raise glasses, bright groom, love you guys. Brandon, there has never been a time in my life where I have not been proud of you. From your first breath to all those times you used to play guitar and all the battles we had over homework. I was always proud of the man I saw you becoming, and I knew the more proud of the man you would become. Jessica? You look amazing today. It has been a blessing getting to know you over these last few years, and I couldn't be happier to welcome you to our family. You have made a profound impact on my life. I don't have any really or great piece of advice other than to say communicate openly, show each other affection every day. Never forget why you guys are here. And with that, would everybody raise their glass and toast Jessica and Brandon? <laughs> Jessica could tell you that she is one of the hardest working, uh, driven, and beautiful people inside and out. Uh, Jessica and I have, spared, have shared a uh, very special relationship since the day she was born, uh, and I am fiercely protective of her. Um, over the years, we have laughed, we have cried, uh, we've had impromptu opera singing sessions in the car. <laughs> We have put others in dog kennels. I'm not going to name names, Colin. <laughs> but most of all, we've loved. Uh, she has grown from the rug brat with a seemingly endless messy face to the beautiful woman that is sitting in front of us today. I would do anything for her, and she was one of the most important people in my life. I am truly blessed to have someone like her in my life, and I am honored to call her my sister. Since I am so protective of her, you can imagine how skeptical uh, of Brandon I was the first time he came into the picture. I wondered what his intentions were, <laughs> and if he was going to make her truly happy. We were only 15, after all. And was he good enough for such a unique and special person like Jessica. <laughs> I soon learned that Brandon is just as amazing person as Jessica is. He compliments her personality in the most perfect way. He has proven his love for Jessica time and time again, and I am very grateful that she has found someone as kind and goofy as Brandon. They are two twin souls that were destined to find each other, and I could not be happier for the two of them. Jessica and Brandon were lucky enough to find each other early in life. Their relationship has withstood some incredible challenges, and they have only become stronger throughout. Their love for each other is undeniable and rare. And they are the true definition of love. Yes. So please, Raise your glass while I toast our bride and groom, Jessica and Brandon, 
If you are ever to enjoy life, now is the time. Today should always be your most wonderful day. Let today be the building block for all the years to come, and may your home be filled with laughter and your hearts with love. I love teammate, you know, 
not as much as her husband, but you know, I love her, you know, like a sister, so everybody understands that. But, um, you know, it, it's just, it means a lot when we all are here to support somebody because you never know, you know, it, like if, if that person's going to be gone or if they're not going to have something to remember you by or anything like that, you don't know what your time is, you know what I mean? Life's too short for everybody. Um, so, I, like I said, I wanted to make sure this is memorable for her. And I did have a song just for you, teammate. So, I want everybody to get ready. So, I want, I want everybody to make sure they can hear me. Can everybody hear me? Though? This is a real life dedicated song. Can I hear you? Can I hear you? Can I She's your queen.
teammate, you know what I'm saying? We here for you, you know what I mean? Silver Ridge, everybody pour their cups up, y'all messing up. Okay, we love you, teammate, you know what I'm saying? Every teammate, you got something to say? We all love you, Jess. You're up. Congratulations. What to say. <laughs> it's wedding day and I am so happy for you two. I, I, I don't know what to say. I can't put it into words how happy I am that you two are finally married. Um, when are the grandchildren coming? Um, <laughs> no, I'm kidding. In due time, that's fine. But uh, soon, right? Uh, I know you two are going to be together for the longest of times, and I know you two are going to be great at this. You're going to have a great life together. We all love you, and we all wish the best for you two. I love you both so very much, and grandbabies, right? Brandon and Jesse, you know I love you guys, and I have no doubt that you will make it all the way to the end. Love you guys. Hi. It's mom. Anyway, best wishes to the two of you. I know you don't need them, but you and my cup got them. And one note of advice. Always, always, always. Jessica and Brandon, we wish you two the best in your life. Uh, we know that you two will make it through anything and everything. Uh, we love you both so much, and we are very excited to live the rest of our lives making one big happy family. I don't know what to say. I, congrats, guys. You, you guys love each other. That's all that matters. Stay happy. Don't fight too much. Everything else will work out. Congrats. Love you guys. Love you guys. I just want to congratulate both of you. And I just want to let you know, Brandon, that you are just like my second son. I helped raise you, and I love you just like I would the rest of my children. And I could not be more happy for the both of you. I want you both to have a great life, and that's it. I love you both.